What's going on my people? What I want to talk to you about today is heaven and hell. Let me tell you the difference between heaven and hell. You have to understand something. Taking the road to heaven, that's the way you want to go. Going to hell, you don't want to be there. But listen, I want to share a quick tip with you today. Matthew 7, 14 says, but small is the gate and narrow the road that leads to life, but only a few will find it. We have heaven right here, just like it said, narrow. We have hell, the big way, okay? So there's gonna be a lot of people, the mass are gonna run, right? Because they don't know any better. They're not trying to get to heaven. So you don't need to be like them. You need to be different. So you need to work on bettering yourself each and every day, surrounding yourself with more believers, staying in church, reading your Bible every day, you know, acting out on Joshua 1.8, meditating on the word day and night, okay? You can't go wrong meditating on the word day and night because it helps your understanding. You're thinking about it constantly throughout the day. You're thinking of how to apply it to your life, okay? So you need to realize, like I said, that's a small road. Hell is a big road, but you don't want to go there. All this, this sin and lust for all, man, you don't want any part in all that. Why? Because it's temporary, okay? And you have to be smart enough to know that you are alive on this earth only temporary. So it's not worth it. It's not worth it. Right? That's like going to Celebration Station and you getting a wristband and they tell you well, it's $20 to get a wristband, but you only get to, you only get to ride the go-kart for 30 seconds. you like, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Because it's temporary. You can't fully enjoy that, that ride. You, you can't fully enjoy it. It's a setup. Right? It's a setup. The devil's trying to get you into his trap. So you have to zone back, think again, and realize the bigger picture. 